Okay guys, so it's been about two days since I went to the convention. Uh, I was only there for like one day uh, and I pretty much maximized the time when I was there. So we are going to go through everything that I bought and we're going to list out how much I paid for everything. Okay, so the, the first uh, few games that I have are these uh, Game Boy Advance's fan translated ROMs. We got uh, Fire Emblem The Binding Blade. And we got Mother 1 and 2. So uh, these two games, it was two for $35. The uh, next game that I have, it's a weird one. It's called Senran Banka. And this I paid $60. I don't know, it's just a weird game that caught my eye and decided to get it. It's actually a uh, visual novel, so... Alright, the next game I have here is called Golden Force. Looks, looks like to be like a 2D um, adventure game. Side, one of those side scroll games. Alright, and this I paid uh, $40. Alright, the next game I have here, the game cover is in Japanese, but the game I have here is called Etrian Odyssey Origins Re HD Remastered 1, 2, and 3. This was $80. Alright, and the next game I have here is called Dead End Request 2 for $60. Alright, and the next game I have here is called Ark of Alchemist. I can't remember how much I pay for this. I want to say $40? Alright, next game I have here is called Fate Extella Link. I bought this for $45. Um, a little known fact, I do actually have this game for the Switch, but I've been looking around to see if I can find the, uh, the PlayStation 4 version, and luckily I was able to find it at the, uh, the convention. Alright, next game I have here is Shantae and the Seven Sirens for $40. Alright, next game I have here... Uh, Legend of Mana for $55. Zero Strand for $30. Appears to be a uh, bullet hell game. Oh, this is a good one. We got Hollow Knight. Hollow Knight. And it comes with all the DLC for $30. And the last game I have here is called Dead and School for $30. That was a total of 12 games I bought at the convention, and I spent a grand total of $545. There was no plan while I was there. I literally went to every single vendor, multiple times actually, just to see what they had and what caught my eye. If you went to too many games this year, write down in the comments of what you got from the convention. Alright guys, that concludes my trip to Too Many Games of 2024. Bought more games, met up with some friends, and did a lot of walking. I didn't see any uh, plushies, like the ones I have on my, um, my bookshelf back there. There really wasn't any that caught my eye. Oh well, maybe next time. Alright guys, that's going to be it for this video. Thanks for watching. I will see you later. Good night.